Hi guys, this is the storyteller. I'm taking a break from my kitty drama storytelling today to tell you a story about where I'm at. Don't worry, I'll post the next binge episode uh, tonight at 8 p.m. Manila time. Well, I decided to share this experience because remember Hanbin's interview? Yes, this speech was mentioned by the host and he said it's beautiful. And darn right he is. This island is really amazing. Yes, you guessed it right. It's no less than the wonderful paradise, Boracay. A little trivia though, Boracay was also mentioned in Lee Min Ho's and Jen Ji Yan's Legends of the Blue Sea, but I forgot which episode. I won't show my face anymore worthy. There are lots of things to be here and even if you just want to laser at the beach, that's fine. The sand is powdery white and it's a four kilometer stretch of white shoreline from end to end. That's one of the reasons why it's my happy place. It has gone through a lot of phases over the years. It used to be a party place. But back in April of 2018, they decided to shut it down for restoration. And then when they reopened in February of 2019, they put a curfew on the nightlife. So it has become more quiet. And frankly, I like it better now. Fast forward to today, the tourists are starting to arrive because the government has been less stringent. But right now, it's monsoon season, the waves are currently strong and the water is usually calm and serene for most part of the year and the beach is kid friendly as well. At the end of this video, I'll show you how the beach looks like since there is currently a typhoon. I've been here for a while, I'll be here for another two weeks. I've done a lot of food trips, but I haven't really documented any of it. There are lots of good restos here with must-try heaven in your palate dishes. Please feel free to comment and suggest what you wanted to know about this place. For the record though, for all the binging fans out there, I know for a fact that Han Bin and Sonia Jin has never visited the Philippines. They have never been here. I just want to get that out there because I'm seeing a lot of videos uh, on YouTube about those, those misconceptions. Hopefully they'd be able to visit this place once pandemic is over because this really is one of the best beaches for me. And I'm pretty sure that they're also going to fall in love with this place. As promised, here's how the beach looks like right now. And pretty much it's going to be like this for the next few days with the Typhoon Fabian. For now, take care everyone, stay safe, and see you in the next chapter of my storytelling. Bye.